Welcome back. I am the average American investor. Again, a disclaimer that I'm not a financial advisor. So if you have particular questions about your financial situation, please contact your local financial advisor. Uh, this video is just for educational purposes. All right, so today I'd like to talk about the Wall Street Journal and a few other things. <clears throat> okay, so the Wall Street Journal. When I was a boy, starting at about age eight years old, I would often visit my grandfather's house, my grandpa Lunder, and he would get the Wall Street Journal because he liked to invest in stocks and bonds. <clears throat> and he would show me the Wall Street Journal and I would read it and I had questions about, you know, what's in there and I would ask him. So I'd ask him questions about everything that I did not understand until I understood everything that was in the Wall Street Journal. So as you can imagine, an eight-year-old boy um, reading the Wall Street Journal and asking questions, um, I, I learned a lot. Um, so again, I learned a lot from my, my grandfather. Uh, the Wall Street Journal, they have a website. You can go to wsj.com. So you can go to the Wall Street Journal website and find information about stocks and bonds and investing. Um, my goal is just to help people learn about stocks and money and investing, just to help them. Um, also, I did get a new microphone. Hopefully the sound will be a little bit better going forward. I'm going to check that out here in a minute. Um, also, I noticed that the Dow is up 200 points today, so that's good. Also, you know, the stock market going up, up or down, it can actually be viewed good either way. So when the stock market is up, then what that means is your, the value of your portfolio is going to increase. If stocks go down, it's good because you can buy more stocks cheaper. So if you look at it that way, um, it's really good either way, whatever the stock market does. Um, if you're a long-term investor and again if you dollar cost average buying a little bit of stock every month um, So you can you know if you view it that way again, it doesn't really matter that much what stocks do in the short term um, Because it can be good either way also as I showed you in that chart in the other video the um, stock market has generally trended up over time so even if it goes down temporarily it's probably going to go up later on so, all right, so please um, subscribe down below, hit the like button, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you next time.